Back in the day, architects and engineers relied on physical drawings and blueprints to design buildings, but nowadays, more and more of them are opting for digital tools instead. Modern architects use their phones or tablets instead of paper sketches to help with the design process, and they have been using real-time 3D and 2D modeling software for years now to create realistic renders of buildings and structures. Nowadays, such software are available for everyone. So if you are struggling to get started on your architectural career, we have a solution for you. In this video, we're gonna go over several free apps that will help you get started with your projects. We're gonna start with Morfolio Trace. This app has been named one of the best apps by Wired, Architect, and many other publications. It was designed to create a natural method to use the iPad with an Apple Pencil, similar to how you can use tracing paper when sketching. The way individuals think when using the app has been given a lot of care and work. The app is incredibly user-friendly, with simple yet effective tools for switching between them. The application combines the beauty and quickness of sketching with the intelligence of computer-aided design. It is a must-have tool for envisioning, developing, and redlining plans as part of the day-to-day -day operations. It enables you to visualize and communicate ideas to clients and general audiences. You can sketch buildings and objects, develop ideas and concepts, and plan your home, workplace, and landscape renovations using the app. It allows you to present renders and photos, in addition to illustrations and graphics, which are also taken into consideration. Next, we have DWG Fast View CAD Viewer and Editor. AutoCAD is fully compatible with this app, and you can edit, view, measure, and find text, and perform other CAD functions with this app allowing you to do real CAD work and you can do that on the go and have the best mobile CAD experience. There is no need for manual to get started with this app because the interface is so easy to use. You can start viewing and creating right away with no questions asked. DWG Fast View can view both 2D and 3D drawings, however, it can only edit 2D drawings. And given all the bugs and user feedback, the developers have a long way to go in order to fix the app and satisfy users, particularly those who have been using it for a long time now. I mean, when many functions were free, but are no longer the case. Apart from that, many people have the same impression about its viewing functions, which is described as useful. The most recent update revealed the following features. Assistance in locating annotations, allowing you to change the text height, performance enhancements, and some bug fixes. Next, we have AutoCAD DWG Viewer and Editor. Architects, engineers, construction experts, field technicians, and contractors, beginners or pros will find this app to be an ideal CAD tool because it is easy to use, which allows them to replace blueprints on project sites with drawings on their mobile device. AutoCAD Mobile is a drawing and drafting program that allows you to view and modify DWG files on your mobile phone. You can work effortlessly across devices, switching from desktop to mobile and back. On your smartphone or tablet, you can view, markup, edit, and create DWG files. Data and DWG files are easily accessible from your desktop, online browser, or mobile device. You can also operate without the internet connection in the field allowing you to bring your CAD designs with you. BIMX Architects who want to access ARCHICAD models on their mobile devices will need this app, and it is called BIMX. It includes the BIMX Hypermodel, a one-of-its-kind technology for traversing the combined drawing sheet and 3D building models, as well as showing information about building components. With BIMX, project participants may easily access comprehensive construction documents of buildings even on the job site. Because it facilitates the contact with craftspeople, this app could be your next handy tool on the construction site. Some of the most important features of the app include hyperlink 2D and 3D, super fast 2D documentation viewer, access to any BIM information related to a building component, there is also fly and walk mode in 3D, instant access to current room related information, there is also the ability to take measurements using 2D drawings or a 3D model. In addition, you can do 3D cutaway in real time, trace 2D drawings on the 3D perspective, support for Google Cardboard VR on the iPhone, multitasking in split view, and there's also a photorealistic mode, just to name a few. Next, we have Floor Plan Creator. With this app, 
you can make accurate floor plans which can be viewed in 3D. Adding furniture to your home's interiors is also possible. Floor Plan Creator has many interesting features such as having doors, windows, furniture, electrical and fire survey symbols which are available with the app. It has a 3D tour mode which is provided. The possibility to have many floors with defined interior spaces for the same project. You also have room, walls and level areas and counts of symbols can be automatically calculated. And the most recent version came with bug fixes and several new features. For those who constantly work on the field reports, collaborate on construction, manage plans and create checklists, this app is probably the one you are looking for. One thing to note here is that now working on reports and to-do lists in projects that you have joined from other accounts has become possible in the current edition. Now we're gonna talk about Magic Plan. Many large firms, contractors and architects rely on this app, which is another excellent app for keeping them and their teams in the office connected. Measurements, 2D and 3D sketches, markups and comments, 360 images and other information can be easily shared. Bug fixes and performance enhancements were their most important priorities in the latest release. Using the app for free allows you to make at least two projects, work together in groups, use the Magic Plane API to get started, which is good enough for a free app. Next up we have Sketchbook. Sketching, painting and drawing are all features in this app. It is not only for architects, because it is for everyone with an interest in drawing and painting. Nonetheless, it is an excellent option for architects who wish to demonstrate their aesthetic abilities. A wealth of fantastic tools awaits you on the other side to work on creative expressions providing a natural drawing experience. In the app you can find a complete set of brushes types that can be customized to your liking, instructional guides and rulers to show you how to use the tools properly, and there are blend modes for layers in addition to other features as well. Next up we have Shaper 3D. With this app, designing and exporting manufacturable models is totally possible. To work properly with this app, you must add the final touches on your Mac, although designing on your iPad using the app is definitely possible. Shaper 3D works with all major desktop CAD programs. You can export the next formats such as STL, OBJ, 2DDXF, 2DDWG, 3MF, SVG, among others. You can also import a plethora of different files as well. Finally, we have an app called Autodesk Format. This app allows you to generate digital buildings using real-world site information by synchronizing designs in the cloud for further refinement using Autodesk software, products, and other apps. Format provides an experience of continuous building information modeling process. In the latest version, there have been a lot of bug fixes for graphics, selection, tools, materials, and a lot more have occurred. To be honest, choosing the best app to help you complete your architectural projects, whether you are a beginner or professional, is undoubtedly influenced by a variety of factors. All the following questions will assist you to eliminate those that you do not require and keep those you do. First, you need to know what service feature you are looking for. Is it for creating field reports, drawing without details, or more correctly sketching, generating plans, only viewing, or viewing and editing your 2D and 3D designs and so on. You also want to ask yourself this question. Do you want a totally free app or one with in-app purchases? Is it okay if the app has a lot of ads and so on? Also, you need to make sure that the app works on iOS or Android depending on what you have. Also, for more details, you can take a look at our blog post. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.